Opa! Tuš, no. Gdje sad idemo? Ajmo. Tako, tako. Bilo bi greška da ona nije došla sam. Naravno da bila greška. Bilo bi greška. Slažim se. My name is Dervish Hotić. All my life I am fisherman. My father teach me and take it me because I am oldest son and uh, I see how my father catch the fish. And uh, that's my first impression in, in, in my life. We grew up in a city where you, you were surrounded, you lived in a canyon. You know, you drive into the city through a canyon, you leave it through a canyon, and there's a river going through it. It's just impossible not to, to be a nature person. Nature is some totally peace. You're going and you are peace of this. This river, piece of river. This creek, you are piece of the creek. This stone, you are like a stone. Yes or no? That's, that's how I'm, I'm thinking about this. You're becoming a part of it, right? A part of because the surrounding. Contact. To, to yeah, he's saying it, that's, it's yeah. a part of being yeah, in contact yeah. with, with it. It's beautiful. Just the people don't, don't have a time to, to, to look it, to touch it, to do it. You're just going in. There is, there is something to the motion, it's, it's true, it's, it's kind of a meditative state that he gets in. I mean, I'll be like, Dad, 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 and it's like, he's gone. And then like, okay, fine, then I'll join you, and then I do my own thing, and it really puts you in that yeah. meditative state, and it's yes, beautiful. <laughs> and then... Three hours later, you haven't said a word to each other, but you're not bored. Maybe you're hungry, and then you'll talk to each other, but that's it. So it's, yeah, it's, it's therapeutic, I think, in a, in a sense, too. I mean, just sitting here and talking about this, really, it's kind of bizarre to me. Like, we're in Canada. Like, my grandma had a postcard of Toronto with the skyline, the CN Tower, okay, because we had family here. And as kids, we would, like, stare at this faraway land you know, Toronto, wow. It's kind of bizarre. I never thought in a million years that we would even travel to Toronto, never mind living in this weird city that you saw on the postcard as a kid. It's surreal. I was 11 when it started in Bosnia. I never saw it coming, really, although my stomach knew it was coming. As a little kid watching the news, I knew it was coming. And everyone was in denial, saying, it's not going to come here, there's no way, everyone gets along. When the war broke out in Bosnia uh, in 1992, in April, it started in our region and it stuck around for a very long time and just changed everything. How you look at your people you thought were your friends, your neighbors, your colleagues. We were separated, almost killed, but we made it out alive. So when people found us, they were quite intrigued. I mean, he was a special guy for the youth and he was a poet and a writer and he would take the kids out of school and say, screw school today, I got the principal to take us all tree planting, let's go. And there was a group of these young men who struggled in their own lives and throughout the war and they wrote all these letters to dad. So this is a letter from another one of his students who he was actually the godfather to him. So the letter goes as such. Long ago you used to call me little godchild. It was very dear to me because it was only a nickname that I could have from you. Yeah. E pa, pročitao sam mailove koje ste razmijenili ti i Duško. I read the emails that you and Duško exchanged. Moj prijeratni prijatelj. My friend way before the war. I u našim razgovorima smo spomenuli tebe. And in our talks, you came up. Da. Trebalo mi je dosta vremena da shvatim. I needed a lot of time to understand. Da si bio odličan pedagog. That you weren't just a teacher, but you were a mentor. Sad živim u Sarajevu. I now live in Sarajevo. Oženjen sam. I'm married. Imam dva sina. I have two sons. Nastavnice, javite se. Dear teacher, please write back. 
he wants to thank you guys for bringing out the memories and for the opportunity to feel this way. Yeah, I know, it's okay. Yeah, we haven't read this stuff since I don't think I ever heard him read it out loud. It's crazy, but... It's okay. I got a fish on oh, I got a beauty, beauty. big one too. Oh honey, but I'd love to get a shot. Oh, there's a jumper, huh? This one is a big one. It's a nice fish. Yeah, it's right. Sometimes we might have about a nice fish. We might have done it. Mm-hmm. I'm jealous. It's gonna be a tasty bugger. Hold it, honey, hold it. I'm jealous. I remember my father uh, going in fishing and bring it to the house and neighbor coming, one, two, three, four, and mother say, hmm, again I have to make it two more bread for these people. For a gathering, yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah it's, there's a communal part of, of fishing for him, so yeah. he would bring a lot of fish home and he would share it with the neighbors or the students. It wasn't just something you would bring home and freeze, no. You share it. Okay. Everybody don't have a good good table. I'm lucky. I, I always have a, have a good good fish and nice table with respect mm -hmm. in my house. We got our smoked stuff, cured stuff, and we got the trout from today, made this morning. You know, you have to be lucky. Are you happy okay. To for for this, this, always always I have this. That's my my story. <laughs> Поздравляю. Поздравляю. Всяка час, быстро. Садись.